The mother comes home and catches her daughter clinging to her boyfriend on the couch at home and says, What? Larissa, what is this? The boyfriend, Hi, nice to meet you, I'm Larissa's boyfriend and future husband, my name is Diego. Mom, just a minute Diego, let me breathe, let me understand what's going on here. Larissa, is this what I teach you? That's how it works, your mom comes out and you put a person in the house that I don't know who it is, and it starts grabbing and it's alright? The daughter, no, mom, I'm sorry and I was going to introduce you to him. He's Diego, my boyfriend. The boyfriend, nice to meet you, how are you, mother-in-law? Mom, it's okay Diego, it's your boyfriend. I also didn't know Larissa was dating, how much news right Larissa, you and her boyfriend, where did you meet? The daughter, he was passing in front of my school. Mom, anyway Larissa, it's your boyfriend and you've already put it in the house and now you're feeding on love in this voracious way, right? The boyfriend, yes, but we'll get it sorted out over time. Diego, what do you do for a living, huh? Boyfriend, I'm looking for a job. Mother, don't you work? The boyfriend, no. Mother, and are you aware that Larissa only studies? The boyfriend, yes, yes. Mom, do you know this has everything to work out? The boyfriend, yes, you know. Mother, why do you love each other, don't you? Because it's true love, right? The boyfriend, it's true. I wanted to suggest something to you. The boyfriend, but mother-in-law doesn't have to worry about anything, I have a place for us to stay and everything like I told you I want to marry her. Mother, do you want to get married? Mom, I was going to tell you, how about you do an internship here at home? Why are you saying there's a place, right? You don't have any money yet, but let's suppose you did, if you were to take Larissa, I as a mother would be very worried. The boyfriend, absolutely. Mom, I don't know where my daughter is going, right? What does it look like? What is this place? The boyfriend, yes. Mother, then I propose that you come and live here. The boyfriend, that I come and live here? The daughter, are you serious, mom? Mother, of course, my dear. And then pay attention, look what a cool idea, you get to know each other, you do a kind of marriage internship, how about it? The boyfriend, maybe. Agreed then. From whenever you want, Diego is waiting for you. My home is your home. Boyfriend, thank you, mother-in-law. Agree on what you're going to do when you come. And that's all right. The boyfriend, okay. The boyfriend, I liked it about your mother. The daughter, she's awesome. The boyfriend, well, it was easier than I thought. The daughter goes to her mother and says, Mother? The mother replies, Hi daughter. The daughter, are you serious? Mother, of what? The daughter, did I come here to live here with us? Mother, Larissa, am I going to play with something like that? Weren't you serious too? The daughter, I was. Mother, so you're not decided? The daughter, yes. Mother, don't you love it? The daughter, I love. The mother, so if you're really sure of your love and that you really want to get married, it's up to your mother to help in that relationship, you're studying, he works, I mean he doesn't work, no one has an income. The daughter, but he's going to work, he's going to start earning. Mom, it's good that he does that. The daughter, he's going to get to work. Thank you mom. Mom, imagine, the only thing mom wants is for you to stop studying. The next day the girlfriend says, I'm starving, where's the coffee? The daughter, soon my mother will bring it, she always does. Mom, hi mommy lovebirds. The boyfriend, good morning my mother-in-law. Mother, what do you mean Larissa? The daughter, you've always made my breakfast. Mother, it did. My daughter, it's not even okay for you to say this in front of your husband. You're now a married woman, one of two things, either you make a snack for him or he makes it for you. The daughter, really? Mother, you have to come to an agreement. The daughter, 
I'm late to go to school, mom. Will you lend me the expensive for the memos so he can take me to school? Mother, Larissa, look at the things you keep saying my daughter. I barely know him. Do you think I'm going to give him the keys to my car? It's nothing against you, okay? But that's how we're getting to know each other. Mom, I'm telling you that I'm late for work, my daughter, and you're late to go to school, you better go. I'm already on my way, okay? The daughter, okay. The daughter, we take a bus, right? Let's go. The boyfriend, come on. Later, when Larissa comes home, she finds everything messed up and asks her boyfriend, Diego? The boyfriend, hi love. How did it go? Her, Diego, what about this messy room? The boyfriend, how messy, baby? It's all organized. Her, it's all messed up and there's no food ready. Where's my mother? Him, your mom has been out for a long time and there's really no food ready. I'm hungry, go make us something to eat. Her, didn't you go looking for a job? Him, I went, but it didn't work out and I went back home. Her, and you didn't do anything. Leaving everything messy, what's that? Him, it's my clothes, and by the way, here's my backpack, my clothes are made of cedar, wash them there and then bring them to me. Her, I'm not going to wash your clothes. Him, you have to wash it, my mom does it for me why won't you do it? Her, I don't know how to wash and I did my nails yesterday. I won't wash your clothes. Him, Larissa, it's your obligation to do my laundry, we're living together, you have to do it. Larissa finds her mother and says, Mom, where were you? Mom, why are you all disheveled like that? The daughter, because I had to do everything at home. Where were you? Mom, I went out to eat. Why? Larissa, I don't understand. The daughter, I don't understand why you're not doing anything more than you used to do for me. Mother, my daughter, I'll explain it to you again. Marriage is not an easy thing, now you have to put yourself in the wife's shoes. You need to take care of your husband, you need to cook for him, you need to make lunch, dinner. The daughter, but I don't know how to do those things. Mother, do you know who is to blame for this? I have that I should have taught you and not treated you like a princess, a spoiled girl. But now it's over my daughter, now it has to be for you, understand? You need to do it, otherwise I'll wonder if you with him living inside or in this situation, imagine how long ago you go to live at your house? Here's buying. What's up? I don't think there will even be a purchase, right? The daughter, but he doesn't want to do anything, mom, I don't think I want to do that anymore. I don't think it's going to work. Mother, think about it. Think carefully so you don't get ahead of yourself, but I told you that marriage is no joke. And don't forget what you promised me, studies. So you don't depend on a man for the rest of your life. For God's sake, huh? The daughter, mom, I think I'm just going to study, I'm going to say that I can't. I can't, he doesn't want to do anything. Mother, daughter, I think you're confused. Let's do the following, come on, I'm going to make a little deal for you to eat, come, enjoy, and keep looking to learn, come. Let's go Larissa. Wow girl. The boyfriend arrives and says, hi love. Her, hi Diego. Him, so, how are you? I have great news for you, for us to solve our problems, look I've already eaten and there's a very good thing to tell you, my mother will teach you how to cook how to wash everything properly and we will be able to live in peace. Her, Diego, look, I was thinking and I don't want this, I don't think it's going to work, you know? I think I'm too young and I still have to study and you don't have a job and I don't even know how to do laundry, I don't know how to do these things. Him, Larissa, you're going to learn, my mother is going to teach you, you know? And another thing, soon I'm going to get a job, I left a resume everywhere, wasn't that what you wanted? Her, I wanted to because I love you, but I was wrong. I was wrong, it's not at the moment, I said, and it's not in your Diego either. Him, are you breaking up with me? Her, I am. It's not going to work. I packed your things. Him, you're going to regret it, you're going to regret it. Her, okay Diego, I packed your things, okay? 
You can take it. Him, did you at least wash your clothes? Her, I washed. Him, did you wash it? At least that. Bye. The mother sees her boyfriend leaving and says, Oh handsome, are you leaving? Him, yes, Larissa broke up with me. Her, it's late. I have a few things I needed to say to you privately, I just didn't say them out of respect for my daughter. I want to say this, I'm so relieved that you're leaving here because you're a burden, and you're going to be a burden certainly in my daughter's life. But a surprise, because I won't let you. Not to mention that my daughter is a minor, so you have two alternatives, either you leave forever and don't look for my daughter anymore, or I'll report you. Him, got it. Don't worry, I won't be looking for her anymore, it has nothing to do with me. By the way, my mom does everything for me. Her, cock face. The mother goes to her daughter's room and asks, can mom come in? The daughter, yes. I'm getting ready to go work out. Mom, are you going to work out? Daughter, sit here for a little while, I don't want you to be like this, that's not right, you're going to work out, you're going to release that endorphins, you're going to start over. Mom warned you and everything I did was designed for you to realize that marriage is really complicated, the only thing mom keeps asking you is your studies, my daughter, don't abandon, don't stop studying because of any man. Because of no one. You need to guarantee your studies so that you don't depend on anything depend only on you. After she graduates, earning her money, then she thinks about getting married, having a family, having children. Do you understand, my daughter? The daughter, you're right, I really thought. I don't know how to do anything yet and it made me realize that maybe I wasn't even with the right person, you know? I think he was a bit of a backrest, you know? The mother, my daughter, I'll tell you what I think, in fact he's also wrong, but he's not a bad person, he's also out of place and very dependent on his mother, so there were two people on the wrong path, there was no way it could work. The daughter, thank you mom. Mother, you are so beautiful my daughter, you will live your future, you will enjoy it. The daughter, I'm going to focus on my studies, okay? Mother, please. The daughter, I'm going to give us a better life. Mom, don't get me any more boyfriend stories, so soon, tidy up but don't bring it home, please. Mommy loves you. The daughter, me too. Mom, go put on that outfit, go work out, go.